Let me stop, let me stop. Bro, y'all already know that beat always gets me fucking hype, bro. But anyway, what is good, Udis? It's your boy, Mr. McDoodies, coming back at y'all with another video with this broken ass mic. But today, I got a story tame. Story tame? What the hell is that? I got a story time for y'all. Alright, now look, this one was actually really fucking funny to me, okay? It might not be funny to somebody else, but it was funny to me because it was fucking ridiculous. Alright, so look. I was at Virginia Beach, right? I was at Virginia Beach. We was on vacation. It was me, my mom, my, and my cousin, right? Me, my mom, and my cousin. So we were just at Virginia Beach, chilling or whatever, right? My mom left the hotel room, okay? So we was there alone. And we was young as fuck. We was like, uh, I I'ma say like, I can't even remember, like 13, 14. We wasn't that young, but we was young. We was still some little kids, bro. So she left us in there for a couple minutes because she went to go do something in a lobby or whatever. She went to go get food or something. I don't remember what the fuck she was doing. She, just, she went to go do something, all right? We was there by ourselves. That's it. Now, mind you, we wasn't in the room by ourselves for a long time, all right? I'm telling you, this shit was like five, ten minutes we was in there by ourselves. Five or ten minutes and shit still goes bad. Like, you, you just, you couldn't leave us alone, bro. All right, so we was in the hotel room just chilling, right? My mom leaves. And not even a minute later, we, we get bored, okay? We was bored in the hotel room. We wanted to go do something, but we couldn't at the moment. So, I don't know who came up with the idea, man. I really don't. But some one of us decided, yo, let's play catch with a fucking egg. Like, what the hell? Why, why did that seem so fun to us? So, I go into the fucking fridge. And I grab an egg, right? I grab an egg. And <laughs> we just start tossing that shit back and forth. I, why? I, I really, I don't know. I just, I really don't. <laughs> so we're throwing this shit back and forth right back and forth back and forth everything's going good we're chilling bro the egg's not breaking you know that's probably what it was we was probably wondering who would um who would fucking like drop it first that's probably what we were doing bro so we're tossing this shit back and forth right i'm standing next to the next to the sliding door that leads to the balcony right that shit's wide open the balcony door is wide open, bruh. So we're still playing catch with this egg. Everything's going good. Nobody's dropping it. We're succeeding. Now, my cousin, he decided to... He decided to beam that shit at me, bro. Like, I'm telling he threw a fucking bullet at me. Like, when I say he threw a fucking bullet, he threw a fucking bullet. Bro, that shit passed my ear. And all you heard was... Ching! Like, I'm being dead ass serious. So, obviously, I'm not gonna try and catch that shit. With the, with the fucking speed that that shit had... Even if I did catch it, that shit was gonna break. I'm not trying to get no yoke on me, bro. That's nasty. So I said, skirt. I straight, I straight leaned with it, bro. I straight leaned with it. And I let that shit fly out the balcony. <laughs> as soon as that shit flew out the balcony, bro, we were, yo, our jaws just dropped, bro. We like, oh, shit. We fucked up. We, we definitely just fucked up. So we closed the sliding door fast as hell, right? We close it. And we just start chilling, bro. We just sit down. We just like, oh, shit. Okay, okay. Let's, let's just act normal, okay? Nothing happened. So... <laughs> Okay. <laughs> we open the sliding door again, right? After a couple seconds, we go out there and we look down. It hit some kid in the head. A little ass kid, bro. And yo, we were high up too, bro. Like we was, I don't remember what floor he was on, but that shit was high up. <laughs> the fucking egg literally hit some kid in the forehead. Like what the fuck, bro? Like how? Really? In the forehead, though? Out of every fucking spot, it could have landed on the concrete, on the sand, anywhere. It landed on some little kid's fucking forehead. <laughs> like, bro, just imagine that. Just imagine you're on vacation, you're walking down the street or whatever. <laughs> you're just walking. You're just walking, bro. You're walking past the hotel, and your kid gets hit with a fucking egg to the face. <laughs> like, bro. Alright, so where I left off, okay? We went back out into the balcony, we looked down, and we saw that the kid got hit in the forehead with a fucking egg, right? And as we're looking down, the mother looks up, and she saw us. So we went back, we said, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, she just saw us, she just saw us. So we ran back into the room, closed this lighting door fast as hell, right? Ten minutes go by, we hear a knock on our door. Anybody there? And we just like, oh shit. It wasn't my mom, bruh. It was not my mom. It did not sound like my mom. So we just stood quiet. We just stood quiet. A couple more seconds go by. Anybody in there? I'm like, ah, fuck, man. So of course, my dumbass went to went to go open the door. Went to go open the door, and <laughs> bro, this is the funniest part. Ready? The the lady, 
the, 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 the manager of the hotel came to our room. She came to our room with the egg taped up. <laughs> the egg was taped up. She literally grabbed every single little piece and taped it together. What the fuck? She came up with a broken ass taped up egg and said, did you guys do this? Like, oh, bruh. That shit was hilarious. It wasn't it wasn't funny to us at the time, but now that I'm thinking about it, that shit was way too fucking funny. How the hell do you grab every single little piece and tape that shit together? Who helped you? Did y'all have like a whole team do that shit? Cause there's no way you did that shit by yourself. Oh my god, bro, that shit was hilarious. Like I said, that might not be it was a had to be there type moment. You feel me? So it might not be funny to some of y'all, but that shit was hilarious. But yeah, man, that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, y'all already know what to do, man. Press that like button. Or if you didn't like the video, press that dislike button. That shit helps too, man. We are currently at 218 subscribers. It's probably going to be less than that now since I said that. Because you already know some people are dickheads. But yeah, I'm probably going to go play some more 2K now. So I can hit SS3. I'm getting closer and closer. Your boy about to be out here with some mascots, all right? 2K17, I mean 2K18 is almost here. We gonna get our hands on that after so Yo, I hope 2K18 is not trash, bro. Please, please, 2K18, please don't be garbage. Do not be as trash as 2K17. Just please. Because if that game is trash, if that game is as bad as this game, I'm going to keep playing 17. Because there's no point playing another shitty game just restarting, you feel me? Like, I'm already SS2 on here. I'm not going to play another shitty game, you feel me? I'm just going to stay on here. I'm going to keep grinding on 17 if 2K18 is trash. Hopefully, that's not the case, though. <laughs> but with that being said, you guys are all awesome. Love each and every one of you. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Mr. McUdy, out. My guillotine, drink with melted zin, drink with melted zin. Taking beans, yeah. go to those extremes. Uh, let's go, let's go. Parliament, Parliament. Carla Mari wins, yeah. Parlay in Vegas, we was in.